And thus, if we represent two genes with the letters A and B, and the dominant alleles from one parent with capital letters A and B, and the recessive alleles with lowercase, one can see that as long as they reside on separate chromosomes, they will assort independently. When meiosis splits these into haploid sex cells, that sometimes the dominant alleles for both genes A and B will reside in the same gametes, while in other occasions, meiosis will divide the chromosomes differently so that some gametes will have the dominant alleles for uh, the first gene, the recessive alleles for the second gene, uh, while other uh, gametes have the opposite. And thus, independent assortment creates a great diversity in the gametes which are produced.